Hello everyone, this is Anuj from Gadget Cake. It's time for the top 10 new mobile games for this month, and the games we are going to showcase in this video are on the basis of gameplay, graphics, and how addictive they are, and most importantly, because they are new and recently launched. And guys, if you're new to our channel, then don't forget to subscribe to us for more videos like this. So let's start our today's video, and as usual, we will be showing the games in random order. So the first game we have in our list is the Frag Pro Shooter. Frag Pro Shooter is a first-person shooting game for your mobile. In the game, you challenge thousands of players in a short real-time one versus one match. You can control your character in first-person view, and they will shoot automatically. You can switch between heroes at the time of respawn. So this means when you die, you can instantly choose another character and defeat your enemy. The graphics are very good and the controls are also quite responsive. You also have the special power on the left side which varies according to the character. Each character has their strengths and weaknesses, so you need to try them all to see which one is the best for you. The main goal of the game is to eliminate all the enemies and attack the shields to get more points. Overall a unique 1 vs 1 PvP game which in my opinion very addictive. So definitely check out Frag Pro Shooter this month. Next in our list is the Grand Mountain Adventure. This game is all about exploring mountains on pair of skis. You get a top view camera angle and the visual of this games are amazing. This game is actually an open world ski game where you can go anywhere you want. There are many challenges where you need to complete the course under a particular time. Graphics as I have mentioned earlier looks pretty good and talking about the controls, you have the ski controls on each side of the screen. In the game there are total 5 mountains to explore but only one is available in the free version. The weather is also dynamic with avalanches, falling trees and wildlife. Overall I find the game pretty good and definitely a good time pass. Next in our list is the rest in pieces. In this game you need to awake the main character of the game Georgina from her evil clown dream. The objective of the game is to swing a fragile prostrate figure through dark and horrid nightmares without smashing into anything. The controls are easy to learn but it will take some time to master them. So there are 3 checkpoints in the game and each will unleash an attack on the boss. You need to kill the bosses to awake from the nightmares. The thing which I like most about this game is definitely the graphics which are very well polished and the sound effects. The style and the gameplay is something which I have never seen in any other game. Overall this dark looking game will for sure give you some chills and I hope you will also enjoy this game so definitely check it out. Next in our list is the Grim Valor. Grim Valor is an RPG adventure where your task is to discover the fate of lost kings by completing quests. You are cast into darkness, surrounded and outnumbered but you must grab your sword and fight your way through the land that doesn't welcome you. It's a side scrolling game where you have the movement controls on the left side and the attack and jump controls on the right side. This game is a challenging hack and slash with fast paced combat in dark world. So basically in this game, you take control of a lone warrior on a quest to restore the peace. Talking about the graphics, you will see some stunning 3D visuals which are very well optimized for mobile gaming. There are total 5 acts in the game but only first act is free. The game can be played offline and also support external controllers. Overall Grim Valor offers great gameplay, graphics and storyline. Next game is the Elder Scrolls Blades. When I first heard about this game, I was surprised that the game is finally making its way to mobile platform. The game has everything we expect from it, from character creating and customization to leveling and skill trees and then armors and weapons. The thing which I like about the game is definitely the customization option of the characters. Fighting is also fun where you press and hold on the screen to attack the enemies and without any doubt, graphics are very good. 
talking about the storyline in the game you meet Junius the elder who tells you about the bloodfall queen who sent her mercenaries to collect taxes from the people of your town and your role is to assist people of your town with their troubles and help them rebuild their houses which for some reason caught fire and burned down The game no doubt looks promising but as it's early access so there are few things which needs improvement first is the weaker storyline and then the micro transactions in the game which spoils everything and sometimes you have to do them in order to purchase gems to pass a challenge Overall it's good to see the game finally available on mobile and there are plenty of other modes coming soon such as arena and player versus player mode which will be very interesting Next in our list is the Squad Bot. This game is not exactly new, but I recently came across it and find it really interesting. In the game you hop, leap and bounce through different levels as a Squad Bot. Squad Bot brings tight platforming to mobile devices with unique and minimalistic controls. Talking about the controls, there are no on-screen controls. Instead, you have to simply tap left to jump left and tap right to jump right. You need to build momentum as you race through challenging levels. The game is definitely very addictive and I believe this is one of the best side scrolling game I have played this year. So if you're looking to pass your time, then this is an awesome game to check out. Next in our list is the Full Metal Monsters. Full Metal Monsters is a new 5 versus 5 action shooter where you battle with metal plated monster dinos in post-apocalyptic world. You control the beast on land or in the sky, and like the other 5 versus 5 games, your main is to kill players of other team and win the round. Apart from the standard attack, you can also indulge your dino into close combat. Every dino is unique and has its own abilities which includes jumps, dashes and regeneration. There are also flying dinos which you can select at the time of starting the round. In the game there are three types of dinos. First is the full metal which are machines and has no biological tissues and then the organic, the old Jurassic era dinos and finally the augmented which is mix of both the worlds. According to me, mixing dinos with robotics is an amazing combination. This game has definitely some potential and right now it's under development, so we will see lot of improvements in coming days. Nonetheless, it's an amazing game for those who are looking for a third person team shooting game. Next in our list is The Clean Road. Clean Road is a very simple game where you control a snowplow and you need to avoid obstacles and help people to come out of their houses by cleaning and clearing the road. The game has basic graphics, but the overall gameplay is very good. and the game is fun to play and very interesting there are things which you might not like in the game such as the ads in the game so you can play this game either in the airplane mode or just skip the ads apart from the advertisements clean road offers a fun gaming experience and can be played offline and due to basic graphics you can play this game in any phone Next game we have in our list is the PGA Tour Golf Shootout. PGA Tour Golf Shootout as the name suggests is a golf shootout game. In the game you play against real opponents around the world in versus mode and you can also play solo and progress through challenging courses. You collect and upgrade golf clubs and experience stunning real life golf courses from the PGA Tour. The graphics of the game are very good and look stunning on the mobile screen. Talking about the controls, it's smooth and simple which are easy to learn. There are over 50 golf clubs to upgrade and each has its own unique abilities which will improve your game. Overall with 72 courses, PGA Tour Golf Shootout is the best among the other golf games we have played this year. Everything about the game is good, beat graphics and controls. So do check it out. And the last game we have in our list is the Rumble Stars Football. Rumble Stars is a multiplayer football game with crazy physics but very easy to learn gameplay. You assemble your team of Rumble Stars and rise through the league in an action-packed real-time player versus player football game. You need to place characters into perfect position and master your timing and also build strategic combos to score goals. At the bottom of the screen you have the energy point which allows you to choose different characters. The team who ever scores 3 goals wins the game. 
the graphics are very good and the gameplay is again very addictive. This game is like Clash Royale but in a football theme. In simple words, this game is awesome and my favorite game of this month so definitely download this one. So that's it guys, these were the 10 best new games we have this month for your Android and iOS device. Let us know if you like any of them or your favorite game of the month in the comment section below. And if you like this video, then please press the like button and subscribe to our channel Gadget Geek for more videos like this. Once again, this is Anuj signing off and I'll see you in the next one.